<laughs> How's it going? It's Wednesday and Goth Wednesday, as Alyssa. Goth? Always. Is it Goth Wednesday? It's, it's, that's what Alyssa says, so I'm All going right. with it. I'm with it. I'll get, I'll I mean, get my usually I'm always there. wearing a black shirt anyway, right? Yep. So. Oh my goodness. All right, so how's it going, everybody? We have got so much to cover today. See, I know like what's going on. an amazing amount of things to cover. Um, what do you know what's going on? Well, right when you hit go, when you um, when you brought up the curtain, we were talking about glasses, right? Uh -huh. And I love the way you look in glasses, but the screen being right here, you can't, I see, can't it, see it, right? Yeah. <laughs> I can try. This is now, no, no, now it's, it's just okay. a blur. No, I don't want you to be a, a fashion victim. <sighs> Oh you can take off your glasses. So let's say, let's say right. hey to Hi, everybody everyone. who's in the chat this morning. We got Aubrey Kovach. How's it going? We got Blackjack is here. Brickanista. Uh, Brickworm is here. Hey. Um, uh, Christopher Chalice is here. Fabu Fan uh, Mike. Uh, I think it's MKE. Oh, I, MKE. I did oh, I did that and I've I said it right too. before. I'm sorry about that. <laughs> um, Hooded Look, One I, is here. I'm helping. And you are. Insane <laughs> Lego fan. How's it going? JMW Music. Uh, Lego bricks and tips. Uh, Johnny Maryland, Cat. Johnny Cat. Oh, did I skip Johnny? Oh yes. my goodness. Hi, Johnny. Hi, Johnny. I'm so sorry. Um, Marilyn Parmley is here. Hi, Yay, Marilyn. Marilyn. Good morning. Mini Fig Chick. Good morning, ma'am. Uh, Andy62515 just showed up. Uh, oh, Pink Wheels 3 Pink here. Pink Wheels Hi, 3. Hi there. Um, Robert Zaccardi is here. Awesome, because I have something that you'll want to see. Shane, Shane, Le Levan. Uh, Shane Levan is here. Uh, Zach Martinez is here. Um, golly, and Alyssa, Alyssa, of course, and um, gosh, awesome. Nice. Well, it's it's Wednesday, it's right? It's Wednesday, Wednesday, and I hope Wednesday. you've been having an awesome Wednesday so far. It's been pretty. It's been pretty chill. It's been oh. busy around here. I don't know, kind of a hive of activity. Yeah. Oh, David's here too. Hey, David. And um, mm, uh, let me coffee. see. Oh, Lego Geek, I haven't seen you here before. Welcome, welcome to the stream. Welcome to the chat. I'm sure everybody will make you feel very welcome. Hey, look at this. Um, we have so much going on today. We have a script. Oh my goodness! Right? Can okay. you imagine? What's so? Uh, what's next? Well, we did. Uh, we're on to pins. Oh, okay. We have pins. very special pins. We today. have spent. We have special pins um, from. Uh, it, let me see. I want to make sure it's. I want to make sure that I've got this name right. So this is actually part of our viewer mail. So oh, right. we wanted to make sure and include it. Um, so, so this is from Jason, um, aka. Fabu fan MKE. Oh, right. Oh, great. Um, sent us some amazing viewer mail, and included in it was two pins made from two by two plates. Awesome. So that's what we're wearing today. Our two, our two by two, new two by two plates. All right. Uh, let me see. Nice. So what which you, one? You what pick? do you think for contrast? Well, okay, we'll go with this. Sure. I think yeah, you've you got, can do a Halloween black and you've orange. You've got a whole thing going on thank you so much that's really it's thoughtful <laughs> we do love the colors and they it's look awesome great. so and and now and then i've got cufflinks too i have some uh, oh, you lego do. cufflinks that our friend lisa gave me at one point i'll have to make so a tie pin all right oh awesome. yeah I thank you so much jason only accessories i'm not wearing my watch today Okay, so we're gonna we're gonna fly through these next <laughs> oh, <laughs> a couple it says of right here we've got what do we have, Flynn? Okay. Lego Ideas approved yes, sets. Yes, so three sets made it through the Lego Ideas approval uh, process, and we're gonna, we are gonna look at those. Um, so. Here, and you can scroll this closed, right? No, because when we open it, it gets bigger. Okay, got it. Um, so here is our, it's the um, Lego Ideas uh, review results. So this is what we got. We have Home Alone, the McAllister House, <laughs> um, which I'm sure a lot of people will really enjoy. Well, and that'll then, be a holiday <laughs> favorite, right? And this incredible typewriter, which I can't even believe. It's I want to see so what amazing. happens. What happens when you turn the crank? Well, I think the I would imagine the little keys go. Hopefully, the little hammers go up and down. Yeah, I wonder if if it goes back and forth. Um, yeah, it's really That's cool. That's a great model. And then we have the Seinfeld um, set, you know, kind of very keeping, friends -ish. keeping in the tradition of like the Friends and the the Big Bang Theory. I gotta say, I'm and this is nothing against anybody who designed any of these things. Like, I'm not super excited about this particular um, phase. Like, I was too old 
to be into Home Alone. Oh, so that was I never see. A thing. Well, you're not saying if, if I've got you right, it's not that you're talking about the quality of the models. No, it's saying that you don't have an, atta matter. an attachment to that. Pop exactly. Seinfeld, fresh. I've seen like maybe two episodes right, ever. Right. Right. And um, but the type and the typewriter is gorgeous. I, I learned love it. how to type on my first semester of typing was on a manual typewriter. Yeah, yeah. Well, I mean, I know it's the <laughs> Shane. They were already old by that point. Shane by says, the way, that typewriter is the right set for me. <laughs> yes, okay. <laughs> so you were off to a great start. No, and I, I think a lot of people will really enjoy these. Absolutely, but they're just they're out of my um, surprisingly out of my pop culture interest range because I have a pretty wide pop in, pop culture interest range. But right, while while the core. Line House is right, just central to <laughs> it's like right, right, right to there. you. Right? It could o it could only be better if it was um, a Paranorman set, of course. Um, okay, so let's see what we got next. Moving, we're we're moving right along here. Friends. Yeah, Kim, I'm I'm there too. I think people who love that movie will love that set. Which what are we talking the about? The Home Alone set. Gotcha. Yeah, I think so. I think so too. Um, it, it's you know, it's a it's a generational thing. I t to honestly, I think like that was there was right. definitely a certain generation that was way into that movie. Gosh, um, that typewriter is so clever. But moving right along. Yes, we've got a bricks and pieces haul. Oh, and actually, though, before we do that, I did want to show we had. Sorry, we didn't. That's remember, okay. We did, remembered at the last minute. You know what? We our have, our script is very fluid. It is. It's very casual. We have. <laughs> um, we actually have some images from our from Ooh, from our movie right. challenge that came in a little bit late for whatever reason, and we uh, we were going to. Um, Share Go those over today. this today. So let's take a look at what we've what we've got. We've got actually two two for that, and then one for something else. Okay, this is super. Okay, fun. so this is from Bookworm. Can we guess what movie this is? This is from Bookworm. <laughs> Uh, Alyssa. Alyssa. <laughs> Richard trying to stay on script is my spirit animal. <laughs> Absolutely. Um, well, exactly. Um, Alyssa, Alyssa Christopher Chalice, WG yeah. Jail, you all uh, got it exactly. immediately. Hooded one, Kim. It's great. And it's also, you know, you could have included this as the, your micro build, too, really. <laughs> it's right. both things. Right. Those, <laughs> that house is great. It is, really. I really love this. Okay, so let's see. Next up, we have. I've got to do this like sort oh, we of should weird talk thing. About that too. What's that? The current challenge. Oh yeah, we'll talk about that. So now this one, now this one's a little hard to see because it was um, it's against a darker background. This is from Wyatt. Now I'm not sure what oh. movie this is. Honestly, we're looking at it from the side. There was another picture of it yeah. from the front. The guy on the top has a gun, and then yeah. there's this uh, the rope coming down. And this this person looks like maybe they have a letter of some kind, and I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Uh, anybody, anybody want to venture some guesses on what this might be? And well, maybe he could, um, maybe if you're here, um, oh, WGJL Productions, can you tell us what, uh, can you tell us what it is? Oh, because Robin Because I'm afraid Hood. I haven't guessed. Robin Hood, we have World War II film, uh, someone says 1917. Oh, yeah, that movie. Yeah. Mm, Robin Hood, yeah, I don't know, the gun would tell me not Robin Hood. Um... Yeah, because that's so, not a crossbow. That's a gun, right? Okay, WGJL, you got to tell us. It's a bow and arrow. It oh, is. Hooray! That's Lord of the Rings. Okay, very good, very good. I'm sorry. I thought when I looked at it from the front, I thought there was a gun, but I was apparently wrong. Very good. We all love right. Lord of the Rings. We are big Lord of the Rings fans. I like all the sideways building on this, right? And there, am I seeing an? Is there an axle going through that two by two round on the front? Yeah, as there's well? like a two by two round on the front. Oh, it's excellent! Right on. I get it. I see it now. See, sometimes you just have to to know where you're at before you can see it, and I see it now. That's awesome. Very, very good. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Uh, okay, so this next uh, one. Now, this isn't actually like part of the contest. This next one. This is right. Just, this is sort of. By th the way, this is just a, some silly fun. But um, so. Oh, I know. R.I.P. Um, Ian Holm. I what know. a wonderful actor. I loved him in Alien as well. He was great. Yeah. Yeah. 
So, okay, so this is from, um, this came <laughs> with the, hey, Michelle, how's it going? Uh, so Robert Car uh, Zaccardi sent this in, and it came with one of the large um, Lego creator sets, like, just like the, the box of bricks that you get. Yeah. And uh, the basic brick sets. And uh, it included this little model of a dog, and he said his daughters thought it looked like Logan. So we just, we just wanted to show oh, you that. Oh, was very cute. Take it over there. Oh, right. Oh, golly. We'll yeah. share it with you, too. There we go. Yeah, so it looks like Logan, right? So... <laughs> <laughs> very cute you know if you say breakfast his ears go up it's pretty hilarious you can do it again and again breakfast <laughs> it's pretty hilarious okay hooray so yeah thanks for more logan the... sightings yes thank you for it's the... like easier than bigfoot sightings <laughs> he's everywhere he's everywhere all at once uh oh uh oh, uh oh! Sorry, I just couldn't see that. Oh, we made all right. There all we go. of our whole hol wow. holodeck disappeared. So look at uh, that. We're surrounded by screens today. It's true. All right, so it is time. So we teased these. We teased this last week, and this yep. is our bricks and pieces haul. We were talking about bricks and pieces, and I just noticed actually that I think there might be something missing from my order. I'm gonna have to look into this. So I'm going to dump this well, out. Well, you've been playing with it a little bit, right? Right, but it's a pretty it's a pretty Oh, significant we could go piece. to the down camera. I am going to indeed go to the down camera. So here is our bricks and pieces haul that we just got. And I haven't been able to go too much into it, but um, we looked at some of this stuff the other day. It's a bit of a jumble, but I'll try and pull out the ones. Now, I think that doesn't belong there. Right. <laughs> oh, we've got some dots hearts. Yes, we do. So here's just a little rundown of the stuff I've got. So we got this awesome hammerhead shark. Now, I ordered two, and what I notice is that both of the bodies are here, but only one of the heads. So I may have to look into that. Maybe that but, was a run on hammerhead sharks. Um, this awesome baby elephant, which I know we looked at. Yeah, there may have been a run on hammerhead sharks. They're pretty cool, right? Cute baby elephant. I like it's actually much lot. bluer in person than it is on the, the thing. Um, we did get these um, stingrays, right? Really, really cool. I love this piece a lot. Oh, look, two, uh, several Patrona. Yeah, now these are actually for these are actually for a friend. But we, yeah, we got the Patroni, um, the otter, Ooh, like the and otter the rabbit, lot. and they are blue sparkly glitter. Well, you know the thing about a blue sparkly glitter otter, right? That means it's magical, yeah. and it's otter than most. There yep. you have it, folks. It is. <laughs> but you were right. You got my thing about about um, sparkles and magic. It's true. <laughs> magic and Lego is sparkly. Um, so here is um, oh. here is it, are those little like they're using they use them a lot for lanterns like uh, like Chinese lanterns and then in an orange they are kind of like the new pumpkin piece. Um, they're really great. We got a bunch of those. Well, I just discovered something about this skeleton here. What's that? Look, they used a different. They used a perpendicular robot arm, so that he can. Let me see. Oh there. no! I just put that on sideways because I wanted to see if it would work. <laughs> oh really? <laughs> yes. Well, I like it. He's like I don't know. He's holding a mic or something. Um, we got some of these great neon green. Uh, uh, transparent bricks. Oh, and look, we've got the transparent green pyramids. pyramids yes. And you know what they're great for. I ordered dots bracelets. Black especially light, glowy dots bracelets. Black light dots bracelets. Um, I did order a bunch of the new um, the new candle flame. I mean, it's not that new, but it is. It's. I think it's far superior to um, the really, really tall ones when you're trying to get like a, a little... Well, especially from. on that new candle, right? Uh, oh, yes. We have three of these amazing angler fish, which my number glow one, in the dark. One of my favorite animals we have now. Yeah, and it's really cool. Again, right? black light ah. reactive. Br black light reactive. We got... Um, we, should oh, make yes. a, we should make a creepy mobile out of these guys. <laughs> got, us, got us a couple of baby flamingos because why wouldn't you? Right. Okay, Flynn, just follow me here. Yes. Technic, a technic school of these guys where they're like, where they move, where they move like this, right? That creepy, would be creepy against a black background with like, we could make jellyfish. Oh yes. 
I love these little, they're like little half egg shell, but also crowns, right? Very cool. Wait, what is, what is Kim saying here? <laughs> Alyssa says she's here for the creepy fish mobile idea. <laughs> 100%. Uh, let's see. So, yeah, we've got some uh, coral, oh, coral. Uh, heart tiles, one by one heart tiles. Uh, you know what? That is so far removed from The Walking Dead now. It has it nothing it, to do with Sheriff Rick it's, anymore. It's ours now. We own that. <laughs> it's our meme. It's a tricky meme now. Yeah. <laughs> um, and actually, I got hearts in gold, um, pearl gold, Ooh. turquoise, and coral. Well, um, the gold would be great details on, a on say, a clock. I got the... Uh, yes. Project. Oh, yes. I got the um, white and black, the, like the gold ingots that have the um, the Ooh. little edges. Ooh, I want to do a wall in those. Yes, yeah, so I was actually just gonna say. Yeah, I know, like a lot of us use like tiles um, for to make you know like bricks stick out of a flat wall, but these are actually really good too, especially if you mix them up. And then we got a bunch of, yep, exactly what I was grabbing. Brown, oh. in brown, we got some pyramids. Which... I want to order those again and seriously get like 150 of those, mm -hmm. right? Those are so cool, especially Ooh. when we're working in carved wood projects. Oh, yes. And I ordered a few of these because I am in love with them. And I always, I hate that the that the little people have to have coffee cups all the time. So I ordered some of these <laughs> awesome Teacups. Well, and also just because they're a really yeah. cool piece. Well, here um, we can have a skeleton. A skeleton. With a crown. With a crown. Having tea. Uh, let's see what else. Oh, yes. I got some a couple of these. Like They're like crazy minifig weird ponytail deals. <laughs> wow. It's tricked out. <laughs> yeah, this skeleton. I don't know what's going on there. So this one here, yeah, so he's, can, he's casting a fire spell to heat his tea. <laughs> Very nice. <laughs> and here, that's what it looks like when you put it on. Oh, to a, that's the, awesome. Onto a head. And with this bent arm, he actually would, could hold his tea properly, I think. Nice. Right? <laughs> what, so like he's a skeleton victim, but he's got his pinky <laughs> up for tea his, and crumpets? He's ready for tea. <laughs> Oh my goodness! Oh, we've um, gone afield here. Look at this. Far Our and script is is crying out. Our script is saying. Okay, two more things. Me. I've got the little. Um, this is from Monkey Kid. It's a Monkey Kid hairpiece, but it's really, really, really cool. It's got like a little I flip in the back with the little like round pigtails on the top, and then little sort of like hangy down sideburn things that are. Uh, tipped with turquoise. They're really cool. That would be um, great for like a creepy little girl character. And then I ordered one of these. I know it's a common piece, but we actually only had one in this color, and I stole it from um, a figure to use in our theater. So uh, I needed to get it back for her. All right. I what don't know. We... I think the. What do you think? What's your favorite piece of all those pieces? I don't know. There's a, that's a there's a lot there, so I'm gonna there's have a to lot go to like. through and yeah. Anyway, um, anyway, I hope you enjoyed that little haul. Ready for tea? <laughs> ready for tea like Logan with cookies? Oh my goodness! <laughs> you know, I've actually been I've been wanting to kind of switch to more tea lately. I've been I'm drinking so much coffee. I'm gonna turn know, into a coffee. I'm terrible about tea. <laughs> Flynn can testify to this. I'm terrible about tea. I make the tea and then it it sets undrunk. I have the best of intentions, it's true. and um, so I have a lot of iced tea afterwards. So is uh, I think it's time actually for, for bum, 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 viewer mail for some viewer mail. And I think our mail. I think I see our mail delivery person um, coming down the road here. <laughs> Look, it's viewer mail. We will perfect this one day. <laughs> Let's see. Right? Is that good? Yeah, so is I wanted, she going to help? So I just wanted to oh, okay, see, see what's in Oh, she says that there is a letter inside. So let's take a look at... <laughs> oh, thank you, Ms. Thing. <laughs> thank you, Ms. Thing. <laughs> let's see what the She's letter gonna says. She's going to get a high-tech makeover extremely soon. Just Ooh. you wait. Grandpa's got to put his glasses on. Hey, guys, I wanted to share some of my extra Fabuland parts with you. Can you imagine? 
I love how excited you get seeing them in my submissions. I'm sorry I couldn't send a hundred of anything. No, <laughs> oh my not goodness. at all. No, I enjoy Jason, <laughs> Fabu fan, MKE. Um, I also made you some pins, which we are wearing. I know. Oh, oh, thank you so much. This is so cool. Thank you. Well, right, we gonna... should go to down cam for this. And I will sure. say, I only peeked at it a little bit because I didn't want to, like, I wanted to be able to open it Just on a here. Little. With everyone. And actually, this isn't now the Bricks and Pieces Hall, so I suppose I should turn that particular little banner off. <laughs> there we go. Okay, sound effect. Creepy sound effect. <laughs> All right. Let's see what we got here. Oh, okay, let's take it off yeah. The oh, yeah. This is awesome. I'm already I'm, I'm already in love with everything that's here. I already want a hundred of all they're of them. they're big and colorful. Oscar the Grouch could live in that so yes. easily. So this here's an awesome Fabuland trash can. We've got a mailbox with some cool printing on it. It's got like letters. Uh-oh, I think this may have to become part of our viewer mail animation. Oh, I'm yeah. Work on. Yes, I think that this will be part. So... <clears throat> Oh, that's... yes. I, I don't know. I got I'm some already ideas, excited. Right? Me too. Um, <laughs> these, which I am in love with. This may be one of my favorite Fabuland pieces. It's actually like a slope brick with this cool roof shingle yeah. pieces attached on. And to then it. hold this up close. I know this camera is not going to focus really well. Um, maybe if I hold it up to this one, then you yeah. can't see it either. But there's texture. It's hard to see on there, but there's wood texture on every one of those uh, green uh, shingles. Really cool. Look at this. So we have a car base with those cool wheels. Those wheels are awesome. And this built in. And then there's this, which is like the car hood. So that we'll be, we'll, I think we'll be able to kind of like make our own little car. That's a great piece. It's really, really, really cool. Um, then we've got this awesome. Um, oh, the roof pieces actually come apart. Very cool. So look at this. So we've got the oh, that's the that's trash the can lid, lid to the trash can. And check it out. It's got this cool like. So I guess it can fit on multiple sized things, right? But it fits nicely on our trash can. That's great. Oh, I love the little finial on top of it is a nice detail. I'm in love with these little chairs, and there's four of them. Oh, oh wait. So can where's see. our where's our Fabulan guy? Oh, I'm not sure. Oh, our panda. Yeah, panda. He can, he can hang out and watch. He's enjoying all of his new furniture, and he just got a car, so I'm sure he's super psyched. So we've got, the, <laughs> so we've got the the chairs. Uh, we've got this awesome little uh, wheelbarrow, oh, can which is actually, different from the regular regular Lego wheelbarrow. Can he operate the wheelbarrow? I, I'm sure he. Wow, he's having some problems. Yeah, if he will have to. Here, yeah, I'll work we'll, on that. Oh, check it out! This is, um, I think, another piece of the of a of the car, like of the of the car bits, like a window. So cool! Look, um, very cool. So we got the front of the car. That's awesome. Oh, and doors, doors for the car. Oh, wow! I think we'll we'll be able to put together like a whole Fabuland car. This is so cool. Um, all right, and now we have some in little in interesting bits. We have a basket here. We've got a wonderful uh, watering can, and we, there was we got one in the Belleville set too, right? I think it was like a like something diff a different color. I can't help awesome. but think of Animal Crossing when I see that. Oh, of course, this little this little pot. Let's see, we've got a broom, and that's like, I think the, that's just like a standard Lego broom, but look at that awesome color. I mean, like now it's, a, it's so cool. Oh, the basket clips on the neck so they can carry the basket behind them, or maybe in front of them. Um, wow, this panda just got a really oh, I know, a um, major upgrade. I know Minifig Chick is going to love this. A tiny ladle. I know, now he can carry things on his back and in a wheelbarrow. He's working hard, He's like, that Cray. panda. Um, <laughs> oh, the radiator for the front of the car, you're right. Oh, I'm loving, I'm already loving how this is Look, I don't out. know that this is meant for the car, but I just kind of love it. Gives it it's, this like I'm weird looking it up. thing. And then finally, the, the piece de resistance, especially according to our friend Drew, if he's here, Drew, it is the carpet beater 
dun, piece dun, 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 dun. for all of your um, your sort of fabuland upstairs downstairs um, fantasies. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. So thank you. Thank you so much. This was amazing. I can't even believe, like, we don't, this is our first Fabuland stuff uh, besides, like, Windows um, ever. So thank you, thank you, thank you so much, Fabufan, MKE. We super appreciate it. Um, that is, that's so cool. Yeah. The, yeah, the panda came from our friend Dave. Like, he found it and had it for a while, and he wasn't sure it was Lego, and yeah. Yeah, that, um, Shane, that carpet beater is too awesome. Well, in, in Fabuland, like in City, everyone has something to do, right? And a lot of it is cleaning and gardening, it seems like. Yes, it is. Well, I did, it's funny, I did my only outdoor... <laughs> Sorry, kids clamor for carpet beater accessories. <laughs> it's a crowd pleaser. It is. Oh boy! Wow, we are. <laughs> hey, and we Here, managed... I'm gonna refill our coffee. I can't believe we managed to get all the all of our things in well, um, look. in the first half an hour. And then, okay, we um, still have while that. While I right? refill our coffee, we'll take a breath. Okay. Right? So here's something we wanted to ask you guys. So we end up with like different things. Like we have all these things, and I feel mean, like, like it features. always features. I always feel like it takes us forever to get to what we're actually doing for the day. Like it's like a half an hour, sometimes 40 minutes in. So we were thinking that we maybe would start swapping out some of the features. Like um, maybe one day we would do viewer mail instead of sticker time, but then sticker time would be on another day and then maybe we would have another one that we sort of swap everything out. So just, um, uh, what do you think? So what do they want, more features? Do you want, more you know, more different features broken up and less time in the beginning? Or do you like the way Things are going now. I don't know. It's up to you. Let's see what you have to say about that. Um, yes, um, WGJL, we did get your micro build, and that's going to be on in the Friday, uh, uh, in the Friday slideshow with all the micro builds. Um, no, I mean, yes, it's it's our show, but it's also our show. It's all of our show here. Everybody here um, contributes to the show, so you know we want to do. Uh, you know, we want to make sure that you guys are interested in, you know, you have a voice in this too. So there you go. Um, all right. So, oh, and I, oh, you know, something I did want to point out in case you're getting any wild ideas. Um, this is kind of stepping back a minute, but my friend Claire posted on Facebook that, and I hadn't thought of this yet, but she did, um, is that the angler fish has that little ball on the end, but it doesn't actually fit in a ball joint acceptor. Wah, wah. Wah, wah. Almost. Almost. It's just like, it's like, like this much too small. Yeah, I'm, <laughs> I'm really thinking upside down mobile. Okay, watch, I'm coming close with some coffee here. Here we go. So with what you were saying about the features, what I was really thinking is, okay, um, the way we have it now, we have, um, there are fewer days a week, right? We, we take off um, Tuesdays and Saturdays. And yeah. we have guests on Sunday. Yeah. And we have the um, build challenge on Friday. Mm -hmm. So that really leaves us, um, what, Monday and Wednesday for, um, for building? No, Wednesday and Thursday. Mondays are our how-to videos. Now. Oh, that's right. So Wednesday and Thursday. So the big question is, do you want more time for building? And we can, you know compress the other features or right. is it good the way it is yeah so yeah. we'll see we'll just see what people have to say i think it's um yeah patty you're right one option is to have like a different one all the time no don't worry look logan cookie time's not going it's, anywhere it's rock solid <laughs> and we've actually got other features that we're by jmw music yeah we have some other things too so i don't know i just want to i'm just curious <laughs> well look at this um, the next item on our script for the day is... What is it, Flynn? It's sticker time, show and tell, right now. <laughs> right? Okay. Look at that. Ta-da! Oh, oh, all right, here we go. All right, this one's from 2017. It's pretty small. We'll see if it can focus here. I bet it will in a second. Look at that. It's from set 70348. 
Um, it has silver details on a clear background. Um, it's from Nexo Knights, um, a new one for us. Um, this is Lance's twin jouster. And it was this cool sort of three-wheeled dragster with techno lances out in front. Techno um, lances. I know. And it came with <laughs> it came with our hero Lance with his um Techno Lance. He was Techno Lance with his transparent orange like armor, which we used in <laughs> Treasure of the Snake Queen, right? Yeah. We did. Um, and his little Lance bot and then the evil guy, um uh, his evil nemesis Rogul, who had there a cool go. purple hood. So I just I went, so Nexo I, Knights we don't talk about much, right? <laughs> <laughs> I love knights and I love techno. It, it just, came with some cool pieces. It yeah, just wasn't, it I like wasn't the armor. for me personally. Um, so golly, okay, yes. Yeah, so so um, I know we've talked about like, and we do do some building off off camera. I've tried to do some building off camera, but I yep. just I just have to let you know that, especially now that my my work has started again and right. things are ramping up at Brothers Brick that. Um, the time it takes me to build off camera the models takes away from time that I'm able to build on the the challenges, which is why I've sometimes missed some challenges. So I'm trying to find a balance between yep. between those two things. We'll see what happens. Well, we're super excited to go to the next step on the Monkey King Warrior Mac. Yeah. So we um, last time we stopped with the um, the arms, I believe. Look what we got going on here. There you go. We've got stickers on it. A little dark there. We'll get in the down cam in a second. Oh, so Bricks and Pieces, Christopher, was from Lego, from the Lego website. We ordered those there. Right, and then right in there, we'll get... Um, can we get the down cam? Sure. Oh, Hooded One, thank you very much. I'm glad you liked the article on Brothers Brick. It was very... Um, it was deeply personal and, um, you know... I wouldn't say it was difficult to write, but it was definitely the the well, most I've ever written from a like my own perspective. from an editorial standpoint. Right? Yeah, like, about my own life. Right. I mean, you've been uh, you've been a journalist for twenty years, right? <laughs> well, I mean, okay. He, yeah. I don't he, know he, if I would call it that. Well, you've you've been you've been writing uh, professionally for a long time now. Sure. Sure. Which I fell into accidentally, but anyway, I wrote an article about um, about Pride Month and Week and my experiences. Um, so yeah, if you if that's of interest to you, um, definitely check it out. Okay, so let's see. We are on bag number yeah. nine. Oh, and for anyone who doesn't know that um, uh, with Max, Max are. Uh, not like robots in that they're piloted, so that's why I was showing you the chamber there with really cool control handles. I think that stirrup piece is a great oh. control piece, right? Arm. Dear John. <laughs> What's going... <laughs> oh, yeah, he always comes in the frame there. So look at this. We have two different sets of instructions we're going to build side by side. Yes, because we're at the point in the model, like uh, like we did last time, where we're building um, sort of the same thing, just opposite sides. Alyssa, hooray! Huzzah! All right, I'm going to... Um, now, does it say that we're making two of these, or are they the opposite? I'm going to guess that because they are shoulders, they are going to be opposite pieces. My shoulders are opposite pieces. I, I've heard that. So I'm going <laughs> to... <laughs> That's what they say about you. Yes. I'm going right. to start here. So you can stay. You can uh, hang out over, uh, on that part of the instructions, and I will take okay. this part of the I'm instructions. I'm just separating this stuff. Assuming we're going to be half and half, I'm putting one Ooh, of each. Ooh, look at all more of those gold ingots, right? I love those. These are so cool. Mm -hmm. Ooh, the container ship. Oh, 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 I'm so jelly. What is that? The, um, the Maersk ship? Uh, no, 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 no. The the Monkey Kid HQ. Oh, I'm I'm uh, sorry. I'm so yeah. Glad. Yeah, that's an awesome. Set. Yeah, it's really amazing. Um, oh, Meredith, you had to go to you just had to go to the Lego store. You had to run to the Lego store the other day. I understand. I wish we could. Ours are. Open for curbside service, but not for actually going in, which is kind of a bummer. Not yet, but we'll, you know. We'll get there. Oh, did I just mess up the whole thing? Probably. <laughs> <laughs> well, that monkey kid's a trickster, right? Yeah, what? Is he? 
I don't know. <laughs> it's, I don't it's, know. <laughs> we haven't checked. It's like, you know. I'll call, I'll call, um, you'll call. I was going to say, I was going to say Robert Campbell. I meant Joseph Campbell. Yeah, that's going to be a long distance call. Yeah. <laughs> I'll get out my Ouija board. <laughs> okay. All right, so we're going to get started Uh-oh. here. Yeah, hey, I'm missing one of these. Oh, there it is, there it is. Yep. We're close. We are very close. Look at close. that, half and half. Now we'll find out it is not at all half and half. <laughs> it is. <laughs> all right, so we have a we have a minifigure here, a uh, guy. He's kind of got like a smirking face and that old school kind of like uh, blue beach shirt. Yeah, what's going on? He seems and to be a little not into his dim sum. Uh, well, I think he's concerned, uh, perhaps, by the, um... By the giant by the mech giant behind mech him. that's attacking <laughs> the city. He's like, I just wanted a pork bun. I know. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so there, there you go. Oh, and he does have a second, uh, scared face on the back. I'll always like to see more scared faces. Yeah, well, that's the one they're showing in that's the instructions. That's when they show in the instructions. <laughs> Again, more of these, what is it, drum lacquer gold pieces? Is that what it's called? Drum Didn't something? Didn't you say it? Drum, was that, someone said drum lacquer the other day, I thought. Yeah. Let's see. Uh, okay. So. Start... Oh, assembly. And we got it's that. It's not click, all click, about. Click, 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 click. click it's not thing all happen. about organizing the pieces. Isn't it? <laughs> For you? <laughs> For me, it is. A lot of it is about organizing the pieces. Okay, I'm going to stop putting together and follow the instructions. Wait, are you going to stop putting together and follow the instructions? Uh, yeah, what, did you just move my comma? <laughs> <laughs> I, didn't, I think I added a comma. You're such an editor. <laughs> I can't help it. It's in my blood. <laughs> I just verged into Napoleon Dynamite there for a moment. Did you? Give me your tots. It happens sometimes. All right, so we're getting. Oh, we're doing hey, more let's do this, this on camera. That'll be so much more fun for everyone else. We're doing this uh, more complicated, uh, this like building with snot uphangs here. There. Oh, I'm hey, hiding my. Do you have a bag of small pieces over there? Uh, another one? No. What are you looking for? Um, these. Oh, I see yeah, you. Yeah, it came I out. I see and then you it... have all the small That's pieces. That's why I said I, I think I messed it up. Oh, okay. <laughs> so if you need your piece, your small pieces, well, feel okay. free to come over here. There's not like a, you know, line drawn down the middle of the table <laughs> yet. <laughs> okay. So, oh, and again, lots of those awesome gold pieces. Ugh, I just love, this is such a great set. And now, all right, so there's my the first bit of my, of the uh, shoulder contraption. We've got a ball hinge here that's being covered by this snot uphang, and we've got this um, oh, click hinge happened? on here. All right. No, something happened. I went, I jumped a bunch of pages. You got that. Perfect. You're back on track? Yeah, see, right. there, there are advantages to paper. Yeah. I agree. Although, you know a funny thing about... Um, about paper? Well, I've been working from home now for three months, is it? Something oh like that? Oh my gosh. Since, been... which, which reminds oh, me... Oh, it reminds me too! So, so just I, I've been working from home for three months, and we don't have a printer, so I've converted to an almost entirely paperless office. I do all my markups digitally, all my highlighting, and all that, so... Hooray for that, but more exciting, more exciting than, than saving that. paper, even. So, I, at some point, I just got, like, way off on the numbering of our, um, of our episodes, because, my goodness, there's so much to take care of, especially, like, back in the beginning. And then some things didn't make it to the right playlist, and it was, it's like a mess. But this morning, I was going through um, numbering, you know, the episode today, and I had it at, like, on, as a... 70 and when i went and looked at our number of live stream videos on 
Yeah. This is actually our 75th episode. Can you imagine? This is our 75th episode. I can't even 75 uh, that. at least hour and a half long episodes. And how did we how many hours did we figure that out? Like oh no, don't tell me to use math right now in my head. I think you said it was 115 yeah. hours or something like that. I, it's yeah, so yeah, the 75 and I have to go back and adjust all of the a bunch of different ones, but yes, this is actually officially our 75th episode, not including the very, very first um, one we did with all the Lego Masters, because that was really, um, that wasn't the official sort yeah, of building chat Yeah, and then yet. that that really, uh, we we first tested the waters on Instagram, and we were like, we had... Oh, yeah, that who, doesn't count on Who was the... it? Michael Kanemoto said that he went back and looked at one of our first episodes, and gosh, we've uh, evolved a lot in, <laughs> in a short 75 time. shows. <laughs> well, you would hope. Oh, my goodness. So, oh, yeah. Johnny, thank you very much for our happy diamond anniversary. Oh, very nice. And actually, we'll be... So, yeah, sometime soon, we'll be coming up, like, in another... If we're doing five a week... So, in another, like, five weeks, we will be... Uh, we will hit episode 100 right around, I believe, the time of our anniversary. Really? I think so. I mean, close-ish. Maybe a week cool. off. In July. Okay, let's see. See how I remembered our anniversary there? That was... I know. Let's see, let's see how so well I do. Not, you're not a husband in, in every sitcom ever. In every ever. 50s. I'm, I'm <laughs> not like Dennis the Menace's dad. <laughs> I don't think Dennis the Menace's dad ever forgot an anniversary, did he? Well, he was he kind of a good have. dad. It wasn't really about him. It was about Dennis and Mr. Wilson. Oh, man. That kid. Oh, that okay, kid. Okay, and for that the record, Dennis that's Menace. another show that was very old when I was a kid. <laughs> it was in old reruns when I was a kid. <laughs> I know. Oh, but they, didn't, they do, didn't they end up doing a Dennis the Menace with, um, with uh, McClucky Clucky? Miley, Miley Cyrus and... <laughs> Cyrus and as, Mar as, Ma as Margaret and Dennis. <laughs> <laughs> or wait, no, he did Richie Rich. McClucky Cluckin was Richie yeah. Rich. Oh my goodness. Very different. Wow. Monkey kids, see what you've done to us. <laughs> oh, oh Brickenista says it would be awesome to celebrate our anniversary and the uh, uh, with the hundredth episode. Yeah, well, we could probably do that. That could be cool. We could probably do that, because we're not going to be going anywhere this year, which, you know. So check this out. I just want you to, I just want to kind of show you, catch you up on what I've got going on here. So oh my goodness, this we is now great. have two of those click hinges, and we've seen that, like, the power of these are... The um, power of the click hinge. It's like... Yeah. Dennis the Phantom Menace, indeed. <laughs> um, <laughs> and then we've got, I built in a couple of ball hinges here on this side, and then there's that little ball hinge, the small ball uh -oh. hinge acceptor over here, right? Oh, all right. Well, it's a perfect time to segue into everyone's favorite uh, time of the day. Look at that. Abrupt turn into joy. More joy. <laughs> more joy. Even more than talking about old shit. Indeed. <laughs> That's right, everybody. It is that time. Hi, it's Logan. Oh, my goodness. He's here. Hi. Yeah, we're going to put this where it's safe. I know. Hi, oh, Logan. Look, he is locked wiggly. in on the cookies. <laughs> As always. <laughs> he says, hi, everyone. Hi. Hi, everybody. I'm why my cookies. I don't know why my voice goes up. Because when every I, like, person voice, on the planet's right? voice goes up when they talk to us. Because I dog. heard they respond. So, see if you can catch this. Good boy. Yay. Good boy, Logan. Hooray. <laughs> Look at that. Woo. Not only do we have Alexa, our stage manager, working for us, but we've, we've also got the... Um... A host of birds, apparently. Oh, yeah. Like Cinderella it's, style. It's always <laughs> birds that announce Logan cookie time. <laughs> Should be squirrels. Or squirrels. Oh, my... You know what? Hey, squirrel. Tricky meme. If I'm just I, saying. If I played the sound <laughs> of a chattering squirrel in here, Logan Cookie Time would be very oh, different. Oh, it, it, it would be extremely different. <laughs> it would be extremely, extremely different. Utter okay. devastation. Back to this now. Okay, so can we put him up here for a little bit? Yeah, I think so. I think we got a little bit of time. Okay, this is a major snot construction going on here. Look at that. Yeah. 
And then we're already seeing some decorations and on. Oh, on because them. you're ahead of me. Mm. Um, a little bit, surprisingly, because usually I'm the one lagging behind. Um, Look at that. We got through our entire here. script, Flynn. We did? Yeah. Wow, that is impressive. Wait, where does this go? Okay, I'm going to pull some off. of these here. Yeah, please. Uh, not the bigger ones, though. There you go. Oh, sorry there. It's okay. <laughs> <laughs> did I just mess up your entire system? Oh, yeah, my what, entire, was there... the entirety of my whole system, was there a system has there? Been, been destroyed. <laughs> okay, so, um, yeah, I don't have a system. Okay, this is this. <clears throat> now I'm confused. The little macaroni tile there. Do you want to go yeah, into more close-up camera for them? Uh, do maybe... you all want close-up camera? Well, yeah, maybe for this part. Don't you think? That would be more interesting. But we got to make sure that we're both on camera. That's the, the monkey only thing. Uh, Lego bricks and tips. Uh, Brandon Passant says, do you know the monkey kit is really hard to build? It has a lot of sophisticated build techniques in it, it does. doesn't it? It definitely yeah, does. A lot of um, uh, technic and uh, multiple hinges. Okay, so I We got, made a couple of mistakes, didn't we, and had to go back. Oh, sure. <laughs> I mean, I, you know us. We, we make, we're pretty easy. Yeah, we make oh, mistakes. Oh, look, I better put this piece in first or I'm going to be in trouble. I'm oh, I can even be on camera. No. Very, very confused. I think I put this on the wrong side. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Let, oh! Everything is destroyed. Right, so you are working on the other opposite arm. Right? I am. Okay. Indeed I am. Indeed! Okay, so no, that looks right. What oh, you... I see. I just skipped a piece. What, did you just turn into that character from... That um... character. No, the one from... Uh, uh, uh... From the Venture Brothers? Yes! <laughs> I usually do. It's not... What is his name? I always get things close, right? I'm like, what is his name? Mysterioso? <laughs> I don't remember his name. I know. The Spellbinder? Okay. <laughs> no! Oh my god, the Spellbinder. Are you kidding me right now? There you go. All Able right. to leap capital T in a single bound. In a word... <laughs> what is it? A word, a plan. It's Letterman. It is Letterman. Um, he is, oh, so somebody is saying, oh, Joe, hey, Joel, Marvella, how's it going? Suggestions for future, future episodes, mills, and maybe how to incorporate oh. Lego modulars with mills. Eh, that's a pretty good idea. We you know, don't, we don't I was know think, too much about mills, yeah, but I some. was thinking about that the other day, actually, and we know people who know a lot about mills, so I think that would be a case where we would have guests on and they would talk about mills. Yeah, for sure. Sure. Right, because I would be that teacher who was reading the who was mean to Harry? Reading, yes. <laughs> that <laughs> Professor Snake. <laughs> professor who was mean to Harry. All right. Um, I would be reading the textbook the night before. Ooh, okay. But I, can I think tell. Brick and, Brickanista. Do you know? I think you build in mills, don't you? Okay. How about this, y'all? Look at that. These. I love these little pieces. These like sort of inversed curve pieces and they're gonna make a really really cool decoration on here oh i like their look what they're doing here i don't know why i'm constantly amazed but <laughs> oh good design what a surprise um but not only do they have oh sorry didn't mean to scare you there <laughs> Not only do they have snot all the way around, but now they're building on the bottom as well with that inverse curve piece Flynn was talking about. So check this out. I'm now I'm connecting this onto this, and I am so in love with the shape of this right now. Like this. <laughs> I am so in love, I'm so with, in love with this right shape now. right now. Of course, it makes me think of Arrested Development. <laughs> then marry an ice cream sandwich. <laughs> <laughs> oh, see, I, I was thinking of the same show, but I was thinking of Tenefer. <laughs> that that's not the same show. No. What? Oh no, that's, that's Parks, Parks and, and Recreation. Rec. Right. Thank you. Close. Oh, you know what? It says bricks Wires and pieces crossed. hall up here, which is patently oh, ridiculous. This is not bricks and pieces. This is not bricks That's and an outrage. pieces at all. I am outraged. I am outraged. I think you should send a very terse email. To myself. <laughs> <laughs> Dear me, what are you doing? 
Okay. Um, what in Animal Crossing you I need you could in Animal Crossing New Leaf you could send messages to your future you. Like you, you could, could send, send a message that yourself. says like have a great day and you could send it to yourself tomorrow with like a hundred bells. <laughs> a little sad. <laughs> a little bit. I think you're gonna need these visas. <laughs> What, sending love letters to yourself in a video game is not sad? <laughs> Especially when you can send, uh -oh. like, notes to Cherry or some of the other fun denizens of Animal Crossing. Okay. I don't know what I'm doing here, Flynn. So... I'm completely... Oh, well, I see it. No, it's... I thought I was missing a plate, and I'm not. So I, I want you to check all of this out, because it's crazy. So you remember we did these little shield things on the feet, and so it's connected with skeleton arms onto the bar of that really cool piece. And then we're going to add a single skeleton arm onto this piece, and we're going to clip it in the space in between here like this. So now we have that awesome little shielding or you know armor if you will <laughs> armor if you will because that's what it's called <laughs> okay you're just i'm just you're just making up phrases of course i am you're that's just like randomly selecting phrases from the history <laughs> of the english language and then stuff happened all right so what i'm gonna uh so we you know we have our shoulder okay here socket here and we we had previously built in these piece pieces and then i'm going to use those oh. little quick hinges that we inserted in here did i get this right oh okay so i will tell you now that one of the difficulties of this model to me has been so far is getting those click hinges uh double and remember we had a hard time with the triple ones yes. as well it's a little difficult because they want to mm -hmm. move and well, they have to be exactly the, in the i don't right know place. what the tolerance is like like uh, a, a portion of a millimeter, right? It's really a yeah, just a it's... part of a millimeter. They have to be aligned. Okay, let's see if let's see if standing it up and putting it in makes a difference. You want me to hold them all? Here, let me give it a uh, go. Not that I'm better than you, but no, you did it last time. Is like, and it was even harder with the um, with the <laughs> three of them. Oh my goodness. Yeah, well, no. I would definitely have to call this... Would you call this an expert set? Uh-huh. Although I think it's, it's you know, probably, you know, 3 to 11 or something. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my goodness. Oh, I got it. Hooray! Now, what, the other side? Did I do these right with the... Oh, um, no, you put it on upside off. down, my dear. Well, that part was obscured. Look, you can't see in the instruction. No, you put oh. this on upside down. Oh, are you serious? <laughs> what? Here, let me do it again. Oh my gosh. Okay, so I have to make cables for lighting sometimes. Yeah, let's put this on camera so and people I can see. I can't even tell you. Zonker would know about this. How often I've. I'm sorry, you can't see anything but the back of my hand. But there we go. There we go. All right. Right side up. And now we can here, you know, move that. That armor around to sort of cover up the gap so oh and there's also one that we pre-built in here whoops whoa my decoration came off there we costume go. malfunction <laughs> <laughs> all right is this i can't help but think i'm doing this one backwards look so now he's got little shoulder armor that this matches awesome. right hmm? check this out this yep matches that it does right? indeed and then i flip it over mm -hmm. so it's like that and then it makes me think that you know it clips in between the other two yeah, clips yeah i got it clicked in between but look mine are going the same way and yours are going opposite it's because they are um i've made i probably did it wrong <laughs> oh i assumed <laughs> it was know. me well we're gonna put it on here i mean who knows and see if we can see in another view but oh, here I'll do this here. No, camera. I did have it right. Is one is one faces one direction and the other faces the other direction. All right, then. or two of them face one and then one faces the other, so that they um, it can bridge the gap, mind the gap. Whoops. Here we go. Well, that's All funny because right. look, I followed the instruction exactly to the picture. So guess where we're what we're doing now? Hooray! Bag number ten. 
And I'm gonna take the super Oh, that one, one went right on. on. Of course and it did. I got it right up right side up. Alright, let's move on then. Okay, yeah, well, this this is this like a gold mine, literally, for these amazing parts. We need a bowl if we could. Do you have any extras over there? Uh, not on the at the moment. Okay, I'm gonna find a bowl. <laughs> Look at that. We have 500 of them sitting right here. Thanks, Drew. Yeah, now we're doing. It looks like arms and hands, and um, we are actually tw we're twinning now because uh, we're making two of these. Although, I would imagine that the, that the thumbs were in a different place, but whatever, it says two, so we're doing two. Two identical, okay. Two identical. Here, look at this. <laughs> we cannot build like this. We have our arms totally like... It's all right. The Gordian human knot. <laughs> Do you remember that episode of Batman the Original Series? Yes, I think we've we've mentioned it before. I love that series. <laughs> and that episode is just crazy. It is pretty Any ridiculous. episode with Batgirl was going to be awesome. Well, she had, that, she had that awesome motorcycle, right? Right. All right, so I'm going to put this here so you can see our ridiculous oh, antics. Technic piece. All right, two and two. One and one. <laughs> I want to see this fast motion. I know. <laughs> and then if it was a cartoon, we'd end up in a knot. Yes. Like Batman. Well, no, well, I meant more <laughs> like... Like... I... <laughs> what are you... What are you I wanted to about? say Beavis and Butthead, and all I could get was Lenny and Squiggy. <laughs> <laughs> all right, there you go. <laughs> All right, look, back to the drum lacquered Lego parts. We're talking about Lego here. We're very serious on the Tricky Bricks building chat. Okay. Very serious topics here. There you go. Lenny, uh -huh. Lenny and Squiggy. Oh. Hey, Kristen Dilts is here. Welcome. How's it going? Hope we haven't missed anybody. We've been furiously building, and now we're going to build two twin hands, apparently. Okay. And we'll see. We can just pull our little pieces from there. I'm very excited about okay, this. Okay, and look. Okay, here's an example. Flynn and I have different building styles, right? We do. For some reason, this just relaxes me if I have them all out. Yeah, I do. And this is how he gets steps ahead, right? Well, I will do that if it's just me building on my own. Or, or like, if it's us building and we're not on camera. But whenever we're on camera, I feel this, like drive to, to keep moving forward as right. much as possible. <coughs> okay, we can switch to the close-up Looks like we've got some stickers here. here. If you want. Oh, yeah, we can do that. So, click. Is that right? Look at that. Click, 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 click. click, click, click. In, in many languages. All right. Oh, I love that there's like a raging Mills discussion going on in the... Um, oh, that's awesome. Yeah. That's I want to learn good. about Mills. Well, we will. I think we should learn about Mills, and then we can do, like somebody was suggesting, we could do, uh, I think it was Joel. We could Where do... are missing a piece, Flynn? I don't know what you're talking about. Look, I'm missing this click hinge. Um, That's because you're back a step. You're work. That's you oh, going back something. to the other one. Oh, you know, no, you know what I'm doing is I'm on your steps yep, now. There you go. Well, we're doing the is. steps together, right? Because we are. Yeah, I was. I we're just winning this time. Thank you. Now I know where <laughs> we are. I'm not sure. I'm incredibly comfortable with that. Oh, whatever. <laughs> Believe me, we're doing way better on that front than <laughs> some that I've seen. <laughs> Just say that. All right. Um, I like this. This is looking cool. Just getting enough one by quarter dark blue tiles for water. Ooh, yeah. Oh, Blair's here. Hey, Blair. Hey, Blair. Welcome. Oh, my goodness. I have no idea what's going on. All right. We have this. Look, this is, this is a major little... Thing going on. A major here. thing. It's a major thing that happened. These pieces are. Uh -oh. I always find these pieces. Oh, I'm turning stuff upside down like Monkey Kid. Uh, 
Oh, here we go. Oh, stickers. No, okay, we'll come back for the stickers. Yeah, we, right? we, that's that's a thing. I may make. You know, I'm, I will probably end up doing finishing this model off camera because I want to be. Uh, I want to move. Oh, I can move yeah, forward. Here on camera. There should be an alarm that goes off whenever I get off camera. Ding, 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 ding. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So, I riv now I've made this sort of like rounded piece. And no. Check it out. There's like there a um, a ball hinge acceptor, and then I'm using these two studs with the with pins sticking up out of them. All right. Which is interesting. And then I'm going to attach this piece that I already made underneath of here like this. And now I've got this whole little unit, ball acceptor and another ball acceptor here. And then you can see I've got my snot uphangs so that I'll be able to decorate on here. Snot uphangs. This is not, this is not an easy um, thing. This is kind of cuckoo. Um, well, I just want, I would be interested to find out. Um, oh, okay. So this is why we are using these pieces. The reason, the reason we have these pieces right here is we are going to add these two sort of funny pieces that have a, an axle hole in the center of them. And they're, those axle holes can fit on top of those pins. So check that out. Oh, who Pretty knew? Pretty cool. Apparently, well, I guess Justin I guess a Lego team. a Lego master builder <laughs> now. Oh my golly! All right, so we're gonna keep. So I just always on, have on. to wonder what was the day like in the office, right? Because there's so many designers are are Lego fans. If you know, if not all of them, you know. Well, I, I mean, they, they have are. to all be Lego. Well, I mean, some of them come <laughs> from fandom and some of Oops. them come from the design world right? sure absolutely um, but for any of them i just have to wonder what the day is like in the office when they discover like oh i can't even believe that works on there <laughs> we have to know your pieces really really well right right hey wilfred welcome so glad you're here um yeah oh you'll be late to the show or you won't show up no what are we gonna do without you Oh my goodness, our um our whole international cachet. Oh my well, goodness. Well, Wilfred, you can always, if you want to catch up. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Not <laughs> that you hard. Have nothing else to do. All right. Um, all of these are archived as well. Well, that's great. You can go back to the gym. I wish. What am I doing here? I'd like to go back to a gym because man. The COVID has not been friendly to my waistline. I'm just saying. <laughs> and yes, I just said waistline. Because <laughs> why not? Well, you said waistline rather than figure. <laughs> <laughs> not that there's anything wrong with that. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. All right. Oh, oh look at this. Whoa. Wait. How can I be confused here? Did I skip it? No, I did this Love. step. Then we got this. Look at this cool decoration. Okay, I did this step here. I love that. And there's your your there's your turquoise heart tiles, right? Nice. Not as hearts at all, but just as like cool shapes. Oh, Shane, 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 you are on fire today. You, I, are you just like, are you writing some of these down and just saving them until somebody <laughs> says something? Because, wow, you're you're pretty quick. All right, we're gonna. Okay, so now oh. we can see why how Whoa. we're taking advantage of these. What's going on there? Well, I, it's funny. Look, this piece disappears between these two steps. Tell me I'm wrong. Look, this is this is right. Mm -hmm. These these, yeah, Technic pieces, right? Show this one by two red yeah. in step two hundred and fifty eight, and then in step two hundred and fifty nine, it's gone. Oh, I don't, oh the red plate. You're yeah, right. it um, disappears, right? Yeah. And then you go back to step two sixty, and, and it's then back. It, it back comes. It's disappeared. It's the mysterious disappear. You know, I didn't even notice that. Wow, let's go. Let's take a look. Which one was that? Um, step two fifty nine. Two fifty eight, two fifty nine. Oh, yeah, you're right. That's crazy, right? Yeah. Doesn't that make that this set of instructions a collector's item? Yes. 
So here's the red it's plate so rare. in 258, but then in 259 it has disappeared, only to return again in 260. It's the magic disappearing plate. Now I don't feel so bad that I that because I'm having a I'm having a difficult time with these instructions for the um for the for the micro diner. So uh, we'll see. Oh, now I've gone back. Well, I think Lego instructions are a lot better than IKEA instructions. Have you ever tried to follow IKEA instructions to put together, say, a bookcase of course, or something? Of course. Of course, We've right? Done it together. Yes. Well, uh oh, what's mm. going on? Oh, I just tried to put a piece put on the something floor. Something like this, and then it wanted to explode out of my hand. Oh, this is one of my favorite pieces. I don't know why I said all oh, like it was a cute puppy, but I love this piece. You can make cool chains with it, you know, to make flexible walls because the corners don't get in the way of the flexing. No flexing walls. I don't know. I am so far beyond any kind See of reality right now. See how my mind works? Right when you said no flexing, immediately I went to the 80s version of The Incredible Hulk and tried to put something together with Lou Ferrigno and Bill Bixby, but it fizzled right there. And I made it a lot better by including all of you in that process. <laughs> <laughs> it's so much more interesting now. <laughs> Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and put my. Um, I'm gonna show you. So remember, we made, we put these two little um, here, I'll just uh, black up here. Uh, ball hinges. So here's our decorator piece. Our little decoration piece is gonna go up, and these are gonna hook in together. Look, I can do that one. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that's right. Wow, that was so brief. That was like the thrill of victory and the agony of defeat. Like all like in I one. One step. <laughs> okay. All right, so yeah, there's... There oh, is... many pig chick, cool. There's our nice jointed arm. Really cool. Here, here's another... Um... Am I doing this again, or am I doing more decoration? And I'm going to start working on a hand. Okay, wait. Let me catch up to you. Okay. Yeah, I don't think you have much more, right? No, I'm really close. No, you've got, there are some red plate, decorative plates that go oh, on here. See, I was trying to rush. No, you know what? I did the same thing. <laughs> oh, I did it on the other side. I see what's going on. That was so, you know, 90 seconds ago. There we go. And can I just say... And can I just say? All right, you ready? Does that look good? And you got one more? All <laughs> most All yes, right. kindergarten teacher plan. Here we go. Let's go ahead and get that on there. <laughs> <laughs> I'll tell you, teaching classes Here. over Zoom is outrageous, especially because the kids know how to unmute themselves, and it's not always amazing. Uh oh. No, you did this. You were like, hooray! Aw. <laughs> oh. Oh wow. Well, well, you know, it is just kind of hanging on there. It's Lego. All the pieces are just hanging on by their clutch power. All right. And that What's one, going on? This has to go back, back on the robot here. arm. Okay, nope, don't let it fall over. He's pretty sturdy, though, I gotta yeah. say. Yeah, well, those flexible ankles really help. You know what? I think we're going to get this done today. Are you serious? It's only 10 after. All right. I think we're doing good. Let me see here. Time for hands. Um, okay. Not just my hand. I'm going to step away just for a moment. I'll be right back. Oh, okay, bingo. Here, I need a hand while you're gone. Oh, no. Uh, let's see. Okay, I'm going to start getting this. I'm going to start making this hand. Okay, I'll be right back. I think it's very handsome. I don't know. Did, did that, does that work? I don't, think it, I don't think the pun counts if you have to, like, accentuate <laughs> the sound of it. <laughs> Oh, no, I'm already screwing everything up. Golly. All right. What? Okay. <laughs> All right, here we go. I'm adding some snot pieces on here, some nice yellow snot pieces. All right. Er, er, er. Here we go. And, gosh, now what? Oh, all right. 
This is gonna be, I think this is gonna be actually a really interesting little, little build. So I've got my two ball joints here and I'm attaching this piece on, which is usually used in mechs and stuff to do, um, to do uh, fingers with, all right? This thing is not all thumbs, it's true. Uh -oh. What, no, she's barely any thumbs at all. Oh, there it is. She needs nails. Well, we've been saying that for three months, for 75 well, episodes. I, did, I gotta say, on the few occasions I've been at Walgreens in the last three months, I haven't been in the nail polish. You right haven't now. thought about getting na um, Lee Press on nails for Ms. Thang? I have thought about that. <laughs> <laughs> She does well, need Well, because then we could restore her to her original vintage self afterwards. Oh, I know. Well, I don't know. It was painting mannequins. That was, Those were college projects. Yeah. Lee, Lee press on nails. I can't you, believe that's, you grew that's a, a new thing. One. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. And they were always so horrible. Just like big plastic <laughs> plates, like glued to your fingers. How come they're so big? They're, <laughs> they're toenails. <laughs> that will never not be funny. It's my favorite part of the of the Pee Wee Christmas special, like hands down. And it's a great Christmas special. Like there's so oh, much great stuff in it. If you haven't seen the Pee Wee Herman Christmas special, <laughs> it's, it's so worthwhile. Good. It's a classic. It is so. There's not Just, a lot of, you know, a lot of modern things that are, and I ooh, consider that I modern, this? even though it's really not. Modern? Um, it's 30 years old. It's a old, modern classic, it? or more. Or more. But, yeah. It, it's good. pronounced armoire. <laughs> what? It's pronounced armoire. What is? You keep saying armoire. Or what? Oh, sorry. Okay. Now you're going down a bad path, I think. I'm sorry. <laughs> All right, I'm actually so, not sorry is the thing. Sorry, not sorry. So here's, I've made these three little fingers and uh, with a couple of curves. And yes, I was right. These are fingers. Oh, uh, well, I think of this fan-shaped piece as the, the sort of... It's the go-to for the hands, right? It's the perfect hand piece. And so there you can see I've clipped these on what to that I... little bar. And now you have... There's something I'm this, doing wrong go. here. What's right. going on here? Yellow. Uh oh. That's there. Those guys are there. Oh, there's a yellow plate missing. Uh oh, uh oh. I know. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. What are you. <laughs> I'm being. What's are his you... name? From the thing. From the thing? John Carpenter's The Thing did not have a character that said uh-oh. No, uh -oh. I'm being... Kurt Russell never said uh-oh, hey, uh-oh no. in The Thing. Let's go. I know, we not... can't be ripping on Kurt Russell. Don't even. Not, not to Flint. Don't even. Don't even be... Especially don't talk don't anything rip on Snake about Plissken. Snake Plissken <laughs> if you value your life. <laughs> Just saying. <laughs> it's, yeah, well. Um, what's going on here? There's like a gold dot. It's asking for two of the. Oh, I see. That's why. All right. So look, I've made my little hand. There you go, monkey hand. You know that reminds me. Actually, we don't we don't talk about Lego Masters a lot, or at least we haven't lately for whatever reason. But I, when you talk about hands, how hard was the hand and arm on the clock man? Very. That was really, really hard. So remember I made this, there's this ball joint here. I've got a ball joint acceptor in here. And so it's allowing it to turn. It doesn't turn back and forth, but it does turn this way. And you're going to make the left hand, honey. Which is perfect, because you're left-handed, right? I am left-handed, right? right? <laughs> am I right? All right, so there you go. There's his little, his first paw, all right? Yeah, so medium azure is Justin's favorite color, so it's showing up as filler. Well, this yeah, is... Yeah, I it, noticed that in the passenger, com or the driver's compartment. This is actually turquoise. This is the turquoise. These are turquoise pieces, surprisingly. Well, who was it who said that um, about Justin's me medium azure? He did. No, I mean, who just Moto. said it? On, Moto said that. Yeah, I noticed. Um, All right. Yeah, several little details. I mean, I, it All goes right, great with your red. hand. No, we're on the, almost on the last bag. I'm opining. I know. 
<laughs> okay. I can't believe it. We're actually gonna finish. We are gonna the finish Monkey this King today, and, Warrior and now today. I have no idea what we're gonna do tomorrow. <laughs> we're gonna have to pick a really small set. Okay, here. Let's put this. No, you have to make a thumb. Yeah, forget what? the thumb's not there. Yeah, but you're about to make. The oh thumb. no, there it is. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, I'm making a thumb. Just go ahead and do what I say. All right. <laughs> he dumped out the bowl. <laughs> <laughs> we are moving on. We got to. We're gonna. We are gonna finish this sucker today. Yep. And we may have to do his. Yeah. And like the next bag is his like little staff. Okay. Which side is this thumb on? You're this doing the left, left hand, hand, hand. So the thumb is on the right. Oh, that's smart. Yeah, it's a nice little connection here. Oops. No, I want to push everything aside so it falls on the floor. All right, there you go. There is our. There's the hands are attached. All right, you can see from the front too. Now, are we making multiples, or we're making one thing now? This we is, are making this is a single. We are head. now making a single thing. Okay, so let's go back to. How about you assemble this? Ooh, and all everyone, sort of look out! We got gold bananas in the house. Gold bananas. Amy and Crystal, there are gold bananas here. I know. I just got to talk to I talked to Crystal yesterday for the first time in a little while, which was really nice. There we go. All right, I'm already loving that there are now gold um, small macaroni tiles. This is making me very excited. Oh my goodness! What the Excuse heck is me, that? Everyone, I need to take this call. All right. All right. I'll Bingo. Bingo. All right, I'm gonna. Here, I'm gonna move to the center while that's happening. Uh oh. Maybe his boss finally saw that we do a show. <laughs> okay, so there we go. I know you're getting like triple bingo today. All right, we're gonna use these curved pieces. Okay, I am already. This construction of whatever this is is really cool. Oh, you know what I was going to say? No, my re the review hasn't come out yet because I've been working on that article uh, that came out on Brothers Brick yesterday. Um, and I've re reviewed the fire truck, the, um, the uh, hidden side fire truck, uh, Phantom Fire Truck 3000. And I got to say, it's got a really, really cool sort of mini build in it for the, um, for the villain who kind of looks like Slenderman. Um, but it's a, the, the build is so, so cool. I really, really enjoyed building it. And for a small, simple build, it was just really interesting and used parts in an interesting way, I thought. Okay, so what am I looking for here? I am looking for a snot up hang that I don't see. There it is. And it's going to go here. You know what? Grandpa's got to put his glasses on because... There we go. And this. And there are some, uh, again, some stickers that are going to go on here that we will do uh, a little later. Um, even though it's sometimes not as easy to do such a thing. Like this one is going to probably be a little difficult. All right. So there we've got uh, this part of the head. I think this is probably going to be the, the sort of neck part. And we have this, right? So now we have these. And this, these surfaces right here are going to get stickers on them. Um, and then it's having me flip upside down and add these. I'm loving these, um, like the combination of curves is so cool. There you go. All right. And we're gonna use, now we're gonna start decorating. Oh, I'm still staying upside down. And we're gonna get more of these awesome gold macaroni tiles. And I'll just bring this here so you can marvel at the the uh, pieces of gold, um, drum lacquered gold, as we all learned. This is so cool. Check it out. I love it. Oh, we're already, oh, is this some kind of thing that I don't understand? 
Uh oh. Okay, so I was wrong all along. This has nothing to do with the neck. This is actually the cage for the driver. So, you know, we have here's our little control area, and we built these clips in, and then we're going to clip these little bars in like this. And now this should fold up to cover the chest. Look at that. Look how cool that is. So it's a little door, a little cage for our driver. Awesome. All right. We got that part done. Now it's time for the now it's time for the crazy head. You know, the funny thing is they show you what you're going to be working on and I sort of never look at it. I think, you know, I think it's because part of the fun of putting together a Lego set is the joy of discovery. Um, you know, and s sometimes I like just not looking at it, which is why I understand sometimes people don't watch um, don't watch the stream because they don't want, like when we're doing a particular set, so they don't want to have spoilers, which I totally understand. So, you know, that's never going to be an issue if you <laughs> have to miss because of that. I mean, it's never an issue anyway, as you well know. All right, so we're going to do an upside down brown uh, cheese wedge. We've got some there. And a couple of these. You know, I should do, I should put this here so I can stop pushing my big arm in front of the camera. <laughs> and right here, like this. And we're gonna do two white jumper plates. And if this is, you know, obviously this is gonna be as awesome as the, as the, as the rest of the model, okay? <laughs> Brickanista, it's like living vicariously through you and not having to spend the money. Perfect. I love that. <laughs> oh my goodness. And I gotta say again, a big thank you to Moto for providing this awesome content for us. Um, I, I, it's you know, I know everybody really appreciates it. Um, all right, so this is gonna be two two by three. This is the new two by three jumper with the. Um, Right here, right? The one the one by three jumper with the two dots on it and a tile. Oh, and check this out. So it is showing us here that um, the way, so we're about to use headlight bricks. And if you know anything about headlight bricks, they have an open area on the back, an open area on the bottom, and then a hole in the front that also has an open area. Um, and it's making sure to let us know that on this particular layout, we are actually placing the hole on the back face down on top of that, of that uh, jumper plate. I'm going to do that with two of them. So now you got this click hinge and you're facing outward, right? <laughs> oh, this is always an open area. It's true. Um, you know, I'm just, I'm stream of consciousness up here, so <laughs> be lucky if, um, if anything I say makes sense. I'm actually always afraid to go back and look at our, um, at our older streams because I'm afraid it's just, I'm going to look at how, like, listen to what I'm talking about and it's just going to be gibberish and I don't know how anybody watched in the first place. Um, okay, so this... Uh oh, so I've got a um, a two a one by three plate, and there's these awesome little printed eye tiles, like robotic eyes, like that, and they're sort of angry. They have angry eyelids, um, and then one of these sort of like tombstone shaped tiles here, and then I'm gonna. Oops, this is going to attach like that. So now that's attached into those head onto those headlight bricks. This is going to be. I think this is going to be an interesting little, uh, interesting little build. It looks like. So I'm going to go ahead and now attach this. Oops, nope, I forgot these little clips. Don't forget the clips. 
Uh, okay. And then like that. So here we go, starting to get a little complicated here. We got these ball hinges, we've got studs on top, we've got clips on the side, right? Yes, this is the head, Wilfred. This is the head of the mech, exactly right. Um, so we're gonna do a snot overhang and a snot uphang on top of each other, like this. And we get a red one by two on top of that. And now I'm gonna take this and I'm gonna attach that to the underside now of those headlight bricks. And look at this, okay, this is like genius Lego engineering. So if you know about the headlight brick, a headlight brick has this little stick out part. It like sticks out above everything, uh, past everything else and makes this tile step back by a half a plate. And now if you look at this snot um, uphang, it sits up a half a plate above that plate. So when I put the two of these together, that fills that gap perfectly. Ugh. Genius. I just love design so much, like stuff like that. I, I so, so highly appreciate. I think that's just, I think it's just genius. And again, you know, if you know your pieces and you know your Lego math, that probably seems all easy. I don't know, despite the fact we've been in this hobby for about five years, I still don't know all of the ins and outs and the, uh, and things of, um, like the Lego math and the plate math and the, I mean, I have a general idea. So there you go. I have a general idea, but not uh i haven't memorized it the way that i've memorized some other um some other pieces of math i don't know i think that's something that should be um encouraging is like i don't feel like our like we build fun cool things i think but i also don't think like we don't use a ton of really fancy techniques like a lot of the stuff that we use is just simple regular building techniques so you know I think that's one of those things like where you don't have to know, you know, like every single trick uh, in the book to make cool stuff. Now it helps if you're trying to win a competition, <laughs> but <clears throat> you know, um, so we're gonna put a snot piece here and we've got some of these brown angled pieces. Oh, wow, this is starting to get I'm going to put these here, and I love these. We've talked about these pieces before, these plates with the rounded edges, right? Whoops. Like this. And then these little angled, these cool angled plate guys are going to go on. And now it looks like we're going to have a rocker hinge up here because we've got the, the base for the hinge there. And we're going to do a plate. Wait. This isn't right. Ah, a clip. I'm gonna do a brown single clip and a plate here. No, this still doesn't look right. Hmm. Oh, I see what's going on. All right, so now we're gonna use these pieces. These are a pretty, like a really cool piece that they've been using a lot lately. It's this square with a cutoff angle and it's a curve as well, right? Thanks. Oh, sorry, I said thanks. Lego Geek says, um, I can't believe you guys have only been doing this for five years. I've been at it since 99. Um, thanks, yeah, we came into, I guess compared to a lot of people, we came in pretty late to the hobby. Um, but, you know, I, I think we also um, approached it, uh, approached it very differently um, than I think a lot of beginning builders, just in terms of, uh, seeing it as an art supply. Like we weren't super enamored with sets before that. We just kind of were like, oh, this is a cool thing. Why don't we try, um, uh, let's try more of that and let's try making our own thing after we bought our first set. And then we just like kind of jumped feet first into mocks right away. Okay, oh, Monkey Kid is upside down. So we're gonna, so there's that rocker hinge that I was telling you about, we call them rocker hinges. There's that rocker hinge we were talking about. And a gold shield. 
goes this way, like this, and then that's going to go into here. So there's that little hinge. And this is just allowing this, what this is doing is it's allowing this shield um, to, to bend down slightly so that it doesn't look like it's sticking out in front, right? Like that's, and then it just does that. It's slight, but it makes a big difference, I think. Do, 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 do. All right. Oh my goodness. Okay, more decorations, more decorations. So this is gonna be the, this is now the top of his head. And you can see that we have all these open areas and we have all these studs that were built in and it's gonna go like this. Brilliant. And it's got a clip. It's got another two clips here, clip, 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 right? And we're gonna put one of these. Now I call these gliders just because, and I know they have another name, but I think of them as like furniture gliders. <laughs> so that's part of our um, our sort of tricky bricks language that we have here at the house. Like we always know what each other is talking about if we say that. So now we're gonna fill in with some more gold pieces. We got some cheese wedges here and here. And then we're gonna round off the back of this head by using these uh, curves. Hmm. Oh, there they are. We got a curve here. Is this right? Oh, another plate. There we go. Thought so. And then we're gonna we're gonna round it out with this curve piece. Look how beautiful that is. Like, look what an awesome shape. So the combination of that little tilted hinge. And these, this cheese wedge and this curve make a really nice shape for the head. So basically what we've done is we've built like this part of the head, like the mohawk. And now we're gonna add on uh, to the sides, which I think is gonna be really cool. All right, so we're gonna do um, a bar with a gold macaroni tile going this way and a quarter brown tile that way. So we have a little nice little decoration. Oh, y'all, this is so brilliant. I'm just, I can't get over it. So we're gonna put the, we're gonna put that in that clip here and we're gonna fold it forward. So now we've created like the cheek area and we're gonna use a gold bar with a dot underneath of it and one of these little, another one of those little curved pieces like we were talking about. And that's gonna go this direction. And it's gonna get attached to here, into this clip. Oops, sorry, into here, into this clip. So now there's our, there's this little ear, right? From the front, it's an ear. And that's how it sits in the back so it doesn't close all the way, right? And you get ears that stick out. All right, now we're gonna do, we're gonna make another another ear, I'm gonna guess. Um, yes, I'm gonna flip over and do here. I'm gonna do a quarter, uh, I mean, a, there, a quarter macaroni. <laughs> right, like that. Here, see it's really starting to come together. So we're covering all of that empty, ugly stuff right here. We're just like, boom, boom. So yeah, those are the cheeks. And then I'm gonna make one more of the little ears. Like this, and like that. Little ear, and that's gonna go in that clip. And there you go, face with ears. And there is a little nose sticker that goes on here that looks tiny, and I don't even know how that's gonna, how we're gonna get that on, but we're gonna do it. Um, so here we've got, so now we've got all this awesome front shape of the head. We've got the sides of the head made, and now we're gonna do a decoration. Um, oh, and this is exciting. So check it out. The gold bananas are eyebrows, <laughs> like big horn eyebrows. Look at that. 
That's so cool. Or maybe it's just a decoration on his on his uh, um, helmet. But I think it looks like eyebrows. Um, so we're gonna use the a gold a gold dish on top of a um, two by two round jump plate. And we're gonna use, now this is an interesting piece. So I don't know if you're gonna be able to see it, but this is a one by one round clear plate with a little handle sticking off of it. Now we have a bunch of these and I have yet to find a really good use for them, but this is what you can do. So, hi, uh, hi. I'm gonna put that little bar, the stud in here with the bar on it, and then it's gonna fit right on here that wow so that's what those clips were for on the front wow you've been working on the head yeah that looks great pretty cool right well so much expression with those three pieces for the mouth and nose yeah so you want to help me put together these we're gonna make yeah. two of them okay so uh these are some of my favorite i love these pieces so this gets a um Wait, we've got, are they two identical yeah, two, pieces? two identical that go like this, right? So I'm... Oh, so that they're mirrored. Yeah, so we're mirroring them by using a pin connector, right? Yep. Like that. And one, end, one of these falls in the one end. One gets a curly Q and yes, and the other gets a ball hinge or like a the well, ball on the end of it. Well, that's one of my new favorite pieces is that bar with the ball with on the it. With the toe ball, yeah. Okay, so I've made that. Wow, look at that compound curve. I know, it's, it's great. really, really cool. I want to remember this for the future. And then we're going to take one of these each. We're going to put a gold grill oh, here, uh, I can... slope on it. What step number are you on? I am on... 19? Yeah. I'll just pull it up like over this. here. And then I'm going to attach it on... Wait. Something's not right. Oh, I grabbed the wrong piece. This is actually this piece. Oh, when you don't have when you, you have a when you don't have a reference, it sometimes the light gray and the dark gray look the same. You're oh, use I that. I see what you're talking about. Yeah. yeah. So and the, then again, this isn't even pearl gold. This is a drum lacquered um, grill slope thing. All right, so check it out. We've got these big sort of like antenna things. And it's on a ball hinge on this end, and we've got a ball on this end. And this is, where's the head? Right, like that. So remember we built these ball acceptors back a long time ago? One of these is going to go in each of those. I'm just turning it around. Look at that. <laughs> Well, and the That's fact that so they built cool. up the top of the head on either side fills that gap on the bottom yep. of the grill. Yep. Wow, that fits so... Great lines everywhere on this. All right, so we've got... Here is his head. And let's do... Let's go ahead and do this one from... Oh, no, where did my little keyboard go? From the go? forward camera? Yeah, let's do this on the forward camera. The keyboard camera. was so small, you couldn't even find it. <laughs> it's true. Oh, look, <laughs> he's, he's, got, got, he's the... got the smiley head again. Yeah. <laughs> there he is. Um, but uh, I know, Patty. It's so realistic, isn't it? <laughs> little headpiece. Okay, so you remember a long. We built in this piece back at the very beginning. This ratchet hinge, and our um, head. I'm just holding it up to that camera. Our head has a little ratchet hinge on the inside. All right. I'm gonna get a little light that goes. And it's gonna this. fit right on here. Oh, like and that. then and then the pin connector behind it keeps it gives from... it support. Exactly. Oh, look how that's trapped in there, so he yeah. can move and not fall over. Yeah, that's what that cheese wedge is for. So he's got a move. He's got a moving head, and he stands on his own, which yeah, is I'm way not... better than my Mac. <laughs> this guy for right now. I mean, this is this is super cool. Why that was so awesome? What Cinderella will get there. It's true, eventually. She'll stand up. Okay, so there's that, and now I believe he's got... I think we might be making his tail. And I think what we'll do is there's actually still um, his staff to make, but I'm going to build that off camera, and I'll show it to you uh, on uh, tomorrow. Let's go back to the down camera. Oh, great. Right. <laughs> because we're already kind of a little bit over We've time We've gone today. a little long, so if you want to stay with us, great. If you don't have time... 
We'll catch up. Okay, but we're gonna do this. We're gonna do this. Fast. We're gonna finish. We're this, gonna right? blaze so through you, this. So are you? This is one piece that you're assembling. Yeah, this is one piece that I'm assembling. Um, okay. It's gonna get this on it. Then I believe we're gonna make a bunch of. Oh, we're links. gonna make two more of those. Yeah, we're gonna make a bunch of links that are similar to this. But instead of the double, it's just gonna have a single on it. So should I, I'll make right, one of these too. Um, am I doing this there right? Well, yep. does this still here? Do... Here, it still looks really low res down here, or not low res? Oh, low, low contrast. contrast it's because we it? have we have crappy above lighting. But you know, what are you we can do? do that. Well, we're working on it. We are, <laughs> we are working on <laughs> it. Always working to improve the build and chat. And, oh, look at this. So we got that funny little shape uh, with the rounded edges, and it's actually going to go in oh, the what? tubes, right? Like that. Oh, on the bottom, right. Yeah, right into the center. And then we're and going to And you know to why that's hook. cool? Why is that? I'm totally tubular. The 80s called. They said they, stay home. They want their catchphrase back. <laughs> they, no, they said keep it. <laughs> what? But don't use it. That is so rad. <laughs> All right, so now we're going to make six of these. Such, that was such a thing. Rad. Radical. It was, it was totally radical. All right, so the rest of these are just six of these. Of The the one that has the ball hinge and the acceptor on um, here. Oh, okay. We can do that. We've got that. We've got that underneath. And we're going to make six of those. Pretty cool. Whoops. Whoa. I know. It, it's easy to just let them fly, right? All right, check it out. So we've got this hinge, right? So because these are all ball hinges, this can be whatever crazy shape that you choose well, to make. Well, and they're they're using this piece more decoratively than functionally, right? Yep. Yep, exactly, to keep it from looking too square, I think. Wow. Wow, wow, That's wow. That's almost wow. there. What are you looking ahead? Previews? Ooh. Um, yeah, well, there's some there's some finishing touches that we'll put on um, later, but let's take a look at how the tail goes on. See, again, like we built this so long ago, there's these two uh, balls, um, the, the ball hinges, and you just connect that in, and then you have an awesome jointed tail. I just love how much they finished the back of this model. Look how much effort. Will you show back to the back side of the model? Uh-huh. Um, look at how much effort. All these inverse curved slopes and bumpers. Something's going on back here. I guess he's going to have That's where his cape is going to go, because he does have this, like, fancy fabric cape that we will add on Cool. Uh, oh, we lost later. a finger. Uh-oh. Yeah, see, he's got this awesome cape thing. I love he's got articulated hands. Mm-hmm. And he's got articulated hands and everything. So there he, there he is. We can go let's back to, move the, to front the front camera. camera. And let's tilt this down so you can kind of see. Oh, gosh, we can't even get the whole of him in. Like, there we go. How about that? Mm -hmm. So there he is. Um, he's That's not pretty completed cool. yet. We are going to complete him no, off camera, close. and we will show you the, um, the final bits tomorrow. And that's going to be including all of his cool little plastic uh, clothes and armor and all of the um, all of that stuff. Okay, now I don't want anyone to share his spotlight when he's done. But now, oh yeah, they are definitely they are definitely um, look at that. they are definitely different sizes. We make which them we knew face to face a little of bit, of course, because Aaron already told us that. And yeah, apparently we forgot. But still, I think the Monkey King Warrior Mech is a great match for Voltron. It's right? yeah, he's got he could probably whip him with that tail. It's his little brother, like yeah, right. So fantastic model. I can't wait to show you the rest of it. Um, I will costume him <laughs> with all of his little, um, with all of his cool stuff uh, today and, the, and put the rest of the stickers on and we'll be ready well, for you. Great. He'll be all ready for you tomorrow. Yeah, so really, really excellently cool model. I'm, I really love it. And with the little city, and we'll look at the whole completed everything with the... Uh, with the little cityscape and all tomorrow. Well, you know, I love that he's in this power, <laughs> uh, power you know, pose. 
was. Well, I loved the experience <laughs> of our dinner party built, building Voltron mm -hmm. with other people. That was amazing, and I like seeing Voltron <laughs> every day. I think the Monkey King Warrior mech is more beautiful. I love all the gold it is. on it. Like, I, I agree. Beauty, you know, action may be more the point with Voltron, and, you know, you've got that, all those references. I love this mech. So what are we going to, golly, I don't know what we're going to do tomorrow. I have no idea. <laughs> why, don't we, why don't we do a surprise? All right, yeah. We'll, we'll, go, in, some we'll of... go into the vault. Yeah, we'll go into the vault. We also oh, have, I, I mean, have an idea. We also still have the mini mech to build from this particular set, but I'm, yep. again, I'm going to do that you off camera. Always, one of these days, we're going to do Polybag Madness, too. Oh, yeah, so we thought, I don't know if you guys <laughs> care about this or think even, but we kind of thought as a as a fun little goofy joke that one day we would do something called Polybag Madness because we have like a giant... <laughs> You do we have a, all poly we have a bags bag of poly bags. For the whole episode. We would just like do poly bag after poly bag. And see what, <laughs> that might be. Really oh, boring. I agree, Brickanista. The colors. Oh, Batgirl tomorrow. Cool. Oh, you know what? That's a great idea, yeah. Wilfred. The bat. Are you talking about the Batgirl helicopter that Drew sent us a while back? I think that's a great oh, idea. Oh, let's do that. Sure. We will do the DC Supergirl Bat Jet tomorrow. That Yay. should be really fun. It's a really fun. Uh, it's a really fun little build. I think so. <laughs> This thing needs an assistant, Polly Bag. <laughs> oh, Polly. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Oh, that's terrible. Oh, my goodness. So, yes, we will do the Bat, the bat Girl set tomorrow. <laughs> She's not having it. We'll do the Bat Girl set tomorrow. Thank you, Wilfred, for, for says, the suggestion. She She's says, like, mm -mm. uh-uh. <laughs> <laughs> we have fun <laughs> oh my goodness thank you so much for joining us everyone we had lots of features look I checked off everything on this super high tech script oh, right here look at nice. that everything yes. is checked off it's true <laughs> this thing please get a grip <laughs> Oh, we love you guys so much. Right. Like, really, it just makes our day. Yep. Um, thank you so much for joining us. And don't forget, if you um, if you want to follow us on Instagram, Ooh. you can do that we, at Tricky Bricks. We forgot something. Fun. Oh, my goodness. You're right. Okay, I'll do that when I get the why, email up. Why is the email important? Final reminder. Tomorrow you are is when you're... Um, your pieces are due for the micro ch the micro challenge, so they are yep. due at noon tomorrow. And also, I'm going to give you one last chance because this starts on Friday. Friday begins our rebrick challenge using the um, the city set, and I we're gonna. It's not too late. I can probably still get you one, you know, because of the of uh, Amazon shipping. I can probably yep. get you one quickly. So last chance. If you need one of these, yep. you need to let me know within like the next hour, and I will try and again get one out and out for you. Okay. Yeah, Moto is right. Moto Moto called it out. So yeah. um, you know, I've shown our micro build city block a few times, but you don't have to be bound to that um, to, to that building. standard mm -hmm. of micro building. Just build something really small. Very good. All right. So don't forget you can email um, us at flynn at trickybricks.com with your uh, mailing address. Um, if you are um, a younger person, please make sure you check with your parents first. You don't want to just be sending mail to people who aren't expecting it. Yep. Um, so, yeah. Anyway, uh, enjoy uh, the rest of your day. If you want to send us something from... Oh, very cool. If you want to send us something in uh, the snail mail, and I know that we actually have a couple of things arriving in our box, which I'm excited. So There's exciting. a postcard there and a couple of other things. Um so you can uh, send us uh, your fan art or fan mail or like postcards or flounders at, at Flynn and P Richard, P.O. Box 11517, Oakland, Oakland, California, 94611. I tried to get ahead of you that time. <laughs> I know, but I was bad. I started. I said our names, and usually I just start with the address, that's okay. so that's my see, fault. See, there is no <laughs> chance of being twins here. Um, so I want to see... We're so different. <laughs> Indeed. So thank you so much, um, FabuFan MKE, for the amazing Fabuland stuff. Like, That's I'm just, so beautiful. I can't wait to figure out um, I want something to build with it. Yes. Yes. Um, so That's thank so you. Thoughtful. Thank you. Yeah. Thanks. 
And thank you all again, once again, for joining us. And we will see you tomorrow at 10 a.m. Uh, just uh, don't forget that you want to stay safe, stay healthy, wash your hands, wear your mask, yep. and we will see you next time. Bye, Bye. everybody.